answering my first question or your first question. What is your favorite coffee ever? I have to say that I still remember today and it was a coffee I had 11 years ago. It was my first time tasting a geisha from Panama. It was a natural geisha and it was so amazing. It was like the most complex coffee I've ever had in my life. And definitely that was my favorite coffee ever. Although I had many good ones afterwards, but yeah. Uh, if I had to choose only one coffee in the rest of my life, what would be and why? Well, I love filter coffee, you know? I love enjoying coffee from the time I wake up until the time I go to bed. I'm immune to caffeine, so I just can drink it. And although espresso is really good, I cannot get so clear the tasting notes out of the espresso. Honestly, my favorite method of drinking coffee is cupping. I think coffee will never taste as good as it tastes in a cupping bowl when you do the cupping. But then you have the grounded coffee inside, so it's not very good to drink all the way to the end. So I would say filter coffee is the coffee I would ever choose. What is your thought on the rise of specialty coffee? Well, we are still giving baby steps in Portugal. I was here when there was none specialty coffee. People didn't even know what baristas were. So I'm so glad to still be here watching and being at these events when you see how much the culture is growing and people are even and normal consumers are getting more and more into specialty, enjoying learning about it. So I think it's growing more and more and that's great. I think we still have a lot of work to do and a lot of road to go, but I think it's awesome, the growth that we have in Portugal. And what do you want to see in the future? I honestly, this is gonna sound so bad. I want to see more people really roasting coffee and not just putting coffee in brown. Because I tell everybody, putting coffee brown is so easy. You just heat it up, it becomes brown. But roasting means enhancing all these amazing flavors you can get from the seeds. And I think there's many people roasting, not many people really roasting properly. So this is what I want to see more in the future, is people getting more acquainted with the, how to roast properly, you know, what happens, understanding the chemistry with the, 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 behind the roasting, so they can roast better. Okay, that's it. And thank you. If you want to add something, you can add. Well, I don't know. Um, I'm just glad to see so many young people and not so young people getting more into this, you know, because I'm in coffee for 25 years and for so many years I heard people saying, coffee is just, you know, Delta, whatever brand. And now people say, no, coffee is Brazil, is this, is this variety? So people are talking more and more about the flavor profiles and makes it so interesting. So I'm just glad to be part of this movement. And thank you for giving me the opportunity to express myself. Thank you. Thank you.